What is going on, guys? And welcome back to my channel. Today, it is time to open up the Charizard Ultra Premium Collection. Uh, the reason why I'm opening this one is because there's a little slit here in the bottom in the wrapping and a little cut on top of the box. So that's how I decided to open up this one. And I cannot believe I am going to actually rip into it. I got all of uh, my Ultra Premium Collections in the mail. So I decided, let's see which ones... Uh, you know, which one is in the worst condition. And I found this one with the slit on top. So that is the reason why I'm ripping this one open. And I just want to start off by saying you guys smashed the, the Dark Rye V-Star video. Thank you so much for watching it. It gained me some subscribers. I now have 55 subscribers and there's over 700 views. So for my channel, that's amazing. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. So let's open up the Ultra Premium Collection. Here we go. Look at the colors, the design of the box. It looks awesome. So let's see. I don't have too much space here, so we'll see what we can work with. This is the play mat that it comes with right there on top. I'm sure everyone has seen it by now. I am not going to rip into that. We are going to rip into what everyone wants to see. And uh Let's get some of the packs out first. We'll go into the promos later. You do get 16 packs inside here. Put that drawer back inside. Decent pack selection. I'm sure people would uh, prefer some other ones, but decent. Get some gold markers there for the games. Oh, this one, the dice actually opened up and they're rolling around in the box. So that's okay. Here's the sleeves. I don't know why they didn't just make the sleeves the whole size. And also, my only complaint is the V-Star marker. Why didn't they make that gold just like the coin? They probably should have made it gold just like the coin. Maybe they missed out on an opportunity doing that. But okay, I don't design it. So I'm going to put the cards aside. Let's get the rest of the packs out of here. And what everyone wants to see. We'll put the packs to the side. We're going to rip into them. There's the amazing promo cards. What? Wow. The, the I will say the cut, on, the cut on all these cards has been iffy. But the centering on this one does not look bad at all. Looks pretty good. To me, it does. I want to be gentle when opening these cards. I want them to go basically directly into a sleeve. Everyone is everyone I was talking to, they're like basically nervous to uh, get their cards because the quality control has been subpar on a lot of these cards. So right into a sleeve right there. The VMAX looks amazing. Sleeve. Oh, and the centering is pretty off on the V-Star. So, let's look at the Charizard V alternate art again. The centering is okay. Could be a little bit better, but it's not so bad from what I've seen. I love that artwork. Love it. Now let's look at the Charizard VMAX. Definitely thicker on the right side compared to the left. Let's look at the back of the card. Yeah, you can see it's off. That would probably be like an 8.5 or a 9 if we were lucky. And the Charizard V-Star, you can see it's like shifted to the bottom left. But that artwork, I love that artwork, though. And you can see how thick it is. Basically, I'm just looking at it a little bit closer. Can't really tell any whitening, but it looks pretty good. And right there, those, those promo cards right there, I love them. And I'm so happy I got them, so I'm excited. So let me just divide up the uh, packs right now, put them together, 
and then we can figure out how we're going to open them today, what we're going to rip into. I will put these cards to the side, and we can compare my Ultra Premium Collection to other people's Ultra Premium Collection. So let's see how we're going to do this. Uh, I think I think how I'm going to do this is we're going to go into Darkness Ablaze first. Let's go into Darkness Ablaze. Let's see if we can get anything out of Darkness Ablaze. Basically, the hit we want out of Darkness Ablaze is going to be the Charizard VMAX. So if we don't get the Charizard VMAX, we basically got nothing out of this pack. Hiding Energy, Dino, Electric, Galarian Mr. Mime, Rookadi, Tauros, Cub Chew, and a, and a Full Art Trainer Pierce. So actually, we got a good, good pull out of uh, Darkness Ablaze right there. So... Let's put that to the side. Darkness of Blaze actually got us a hit, which is awesome. Now we're going to Vivid Voltage. Vivid Voltage, the main hit you want out of Vivid Voltage. I mean, any Amazing Rare would be cool, but you want that Rainbow Pikachu VMAX. That, that's what you want. You want the Rainbow Pikachu VMAX out of Vivid Voltage. So let's go into this. We're starting over with Dwat, Opal, Matang, Talo, Yanma, Wooper, Dedene, Picky Peck, Reverse, Loudred, and a regular rare Banette. So nothing out of Vivid Voltage. Let's go into Fusion Strike. I'm sure people won't be happy with the fact that you get three Fusion Strike in the Ultra Premium Collection. But you can still get some good alternate arts out of Fusion Strike. So hopefully we can get an alternate art Mew out of Fusion Strike right now. And I'm going to try to somewhat go through this quickly because there are quite a bit of packs. Don't want to make this video so extremely long. So let's see if we can get something good besides these promos out of this Ultra Premium Collection. And a Hollow Steelix. So Fusion Strike just gives us a Hollow on the first pack and obviously i will recap what we get today on this video and i will take another look at those promo cards because i love them speaking about the promo cards i've been seeing people online offering money for good uh quality promo cards probably because the quality control out of this first wave has not been what we all expect or want necessarily so a gangar v we get and i wouldn't be surprised if the quality control actually gets better as reprints for the charizard ultra premium collection come along because they're going to rush to get it out and then next thing you know the next reprints actually might have better quality so that might be something to look for that's my guess i wouldn't be shocked at all so people are offering good money because probably gem in tens in these promo cards is going to be hard to come by Chutal, Volibi, Chutal again, Reverse Cross Seaver, and a Hollow Galarian Obstagoon. So some Hollows we got today. And we are going to go into, we're going to save Evolving Sky. So let's go into Astral Radiance. Besides the Darkness Ablaze and the Fusion Strike, the pack selection is what we would expect. And it's pretty good. Astral Radiance you're going to want, Lost Origin you're going to want, Brilliant Stars you want, and especially Evolving Skies. So I'm happy there's three Evolving Skies packs because I'm sure we would want more, which obviously we want more, but they're not going to give you so many Evolving Skies. Quillfish, Ralts, and a Cleaver. So nothing out of that first one. Let's go into the second pack of Astral Radiance. Hopefully we can get an alternate art of some sort out of any of these packs an alternate art would be amazing grant pile of swine hisuian electrode togepi combi chadot psyduck drifloon reverse gape draw bog and a hollow reggie gigas so we're getting a lot of hollows today too many hollows in my opinion 
We want to start seeing more hits. More hits is what we want out of this. I'll, I'll even take a trainer gallery card out of some of these sets. Let's see what we can get out of the last Astral Radiance pack. Krikatoon, Magnemite, Teddy Ursa, Hisuian Sneasel, Mystery of this, Barboach, Reverse Identified Fossil, and a Shaman Regular Rare. Uh, we will go into Lost Origin now. I'm going to save Evolving Skies for last. Those are, that's like the hottest set still from Sword and Shield out. So we'll go into Evolving Skies last. We'll save that for last. Because you never know if we can get that uh, Umbreon alternate art. That would be so amazing if we could. Licky Licky, Slugma, Tynamo, Litleo, Mianfu, Litwick. Oh, very nice. Beautiful Trainer Gallery, Pikachu, and Giratina V Full Art. That's an awesome pull right there. Nice double banger pack. So let's sleeve up this Pikachu. And that's a beautiful Giratina V Full Art. So that's awesome right there. We will take that all day. So great pack from Lost Origins right there. For a second, I'm like, wait, Giratina? I'm like, oh my god, is that the alternate art? If we got an alternate art Giratina V, oh my god, that would be so amazing. But hopefully the chase of the alternate art Aerodactyl can come to an end right now out of this pack. Let's see. Box of Disaster, Hisuian Sligu, Electric, Roselia, Gumi, Metatite, Squalvit, Gligar, Reverse Machoke, and a gold card, Lost Vacuum. So, very nice secret rare card pull from Lost Origin. We got gold. So, Lost Origin came in big today for us out of this Ultra Premium Collection. So, hey, we'll take it. Lost Origin just started picking up what everybody else wasn't getting us. So, now let's go into Brilliant Stars Let's see if Brilliant Stars can bring us anything. Unbelievably, out of Brilliant Stars, I have not pulled the Rainbow Rare Charizard V-Star. I, I have not got it. I didn't get the I haven't gotten the regular one. I am I, like I got the Ultimate Art Charizard, the best card you can get, but I can't get the V-Star and I can't get the Rainbow. So go figure. Nose Pass, Snow Runt, Reverse, Mana Fee. An Electivire. So nothing out of that first Brilliant Stars. Oh, actually, I made a mistake. It's three Brilliant Stars. I thought it was two. So three chances at uh, Rainbow Rare Charizard. That would be great if we can get that. All right, let's see what we can get out of this one. Torkoal. Piplup. Shroomish. Throw, cast form, trap inch, reverse clay doll, and a Lapras. So nothing out of that pack of Brilliant Stars. Brilliant Stars, this last pack, you gotta you gotta bring something because I love this set. Alright, let's see. Right, let's see if Brilliant Stars can give us something out of this. Claydol, Bidoof, Sneasel, Grimer, Execute, Farfetched, Reverse, Duskull, and a Honchkrow V Full Art. So we're getting some good pulls. All right, Brilliant Stars at least got us something. Would have been disappointed if we got nothing from Brilliant Stars. So we got a Honchkrow V Full Art. So hey, I'll take it. Now let's go into Evolving Skies, the last three packs of the Ultra Premium Collection. Hopefully Evolving Skies can bring us something. We, I, I, I want any alternate art out of Evolving Skies. And this thing, this Ultra Premium Collection would be so amazing. Any alternate art. I'll take any one of them. Carvana, Dwebble, Mareep, Drowsy, Scraggy. Reverse Treasure Energy and Umbreon V. So we get a V pull out of 
the first pack of Evolving Skies. Oh man, heart is racing. We all we all want an alternate art from Evolving Skies. We all want the same one too. That Umbreon alternate art would be so amazing to pull. Let's see what we can get. Water Energy, Scrafty, Ursaring, Crystal Cave, Pumpkaboo, Bagon, Love Disc, C Dot, another C Dot, Reverse Spirit Mask, and a non hollow pincer. Let's see if we can get some last pack magic. Last pack magic from Evolving Skies from the Ultra Premium Collection. Let's do it. Hopefully. We get an alternate art. That would be so amazing to end this video on an alternate art pull. Let's see what we can do. Crustle. Rescue Carrier. Crystal Cave. Bag on. Love Disc. C Dot. Slack Off. Flabebe. Reverse Braviary. And the last pull. A Hollow Reggie Drago. So, no alternate art from evolving skies but we did get decent pulls today we shouldn't be disappointed because we got honch crow v full art we got gold lost vacuum we did get an umbreon v out of evolving skies and lost origin did give us giratina v full art and that pikachu from the trainer gallery so we also got gengar v we got from Darkness Ablaze, the Full Art Trainer Pierce. And don't forget the amazing three promo cards that you get from the Ultra Premium Collection. These cards, oh, dropping them now. Just want to be able to put them all in my hand on camera. This is what we all came to see. I love it. Please like this video. Please subscribe if you have not subscribed to my channel. Thank you everyone who's been smashing the last uh, Dark Ride V-Star video that I uploaded. And I see that 95% of people that viewed that video are not subscribed to my channel. If you all subscribe, that would be awesome. That would be so great for this channel. Please do it. Please like this video. Please subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you next time.